now for moto mcq equivalent resistance between a and b that point is a and that point is b okay so how can we determine equivalent resistance between a and b so first of all if you see very carefully these two are same potential these two point that point and that point are same potential clear why because no resistance between connecting between these two terminals that's why no any other element also connected that's why same potential and this two and that two are series combination these two that is four kilo ohm similarly two q and here two kilo ohm two kilo ohm two kilo ohm that is four kilo ohm similarly here two kilo ohm and two kilo ohm are series so combination four kilo ohm here two kilo ohm and two kilo ohm are series so combination four kilo ohm clear after that read of the circuit okay a and that is b point and here condition is considered c and that point is considered d it is clear 4 kilo ohm and 4 kilo ohm are parallel so here 4 kilo ohm here 4 kilo ohm similarly a to d 4 kilo ohm a to d 4 kilo ohm so connect here 4 kilo ohm 4 kilo ohm okay after that that 4 kilo ohm and that 4 kilo ohm represent here here b2 c b2 c and here b2 d b2 d after that combination of these two that is 2 kilo ohm combination of these two that is 2 kilo ohm okay now 2 kilo ohm and 4 kilo ohm are series so 6 kilo ohm 2 kilo that 2 kilo ohm and that is 4 kilo ohm are series that is 6 kilo ohm okay after that a and that is b 6 kilo ohm and here 6 kilo ohm both are parallel so combination of these two that is 3 kilo ohms is the right answer make it if end out then comment it i will discuss again